In this video, we will look at how to allow users to self-enroll in your course in Moodle 2.0, as it is a little different from how it was in 1.9. When you first created your course in Moodle 2.0, you may have noticed that there was no longer the course enrollable option and nowhere to set an enrollment key for students. These options are still there, but they are simply in a different place. Once you have set up your course, you need to look in the settings panel under Course Administration. Drop down the Users section by clicking on the little arrow and there you will see Enrollment Methods. If you drop down that section you will see that you only have Manual Enrollments. Click on the words Enrollment Methods. You will see that Manual Enrollments is enabled and that Self-Enrollment Student is disabled. Guest access may be enabled or disabled, depending on whether you chose to allow it when you first created your course. Click on the closed eye by self-enrollment student to enable this feature. Then click the edit button to change the settings for self-enrollment. Leave the custom instance name blank. This will rename it from self-enrollment student to something else. Allow self-enrollment is now set to yes. Here you can set your enrollment key. In addition to restricting access to the course to only those who know the key, use of a group enrollment key means users are automatically added to the group when they enrol in the course. To use a group enrollment key, an enrollment key must be specified in the course settings as well as the group enrollment key in the group settings. The default role for those self-enrolling is student. You can set the enrollment period, a start and end date for enrollment, whether they are automatically unenrolled after being inactive for a certain period of time. Also, the maximum number of spaces available in the course. Setting it to zero means that there are unlimited spaces. Here, you can choose whether a welcome message is sent when students enrol, and you can create your own welcome message. If you leave this blank, the default welcome message will be sent. Save Changes applies all these settings to your course. Students will now be able to enrol themselves.